The line of duty death funeral is typically reserved for police officers who are killed on the job. However, that is being afforded to Adid Fayez today as this will be able to give his family much needed support for years to come and shows that regardless of whether these police officers are on or off the job, dangers are out everywhere. The body of Adid Fayaz has been prepared according to Islamic tradition and was transferred from the medical examiner's office to the funeral home in Brooklyn with full NYPD honors. We want to remember him. We don't want to forget his, his legacy, his personality, uh, his dedication to the job. The 26-year-old was shot over the weekend during an attempted robbery in East New York while off the job. He died days later, and the alleged killer, Randy Jones, is now in jail after appearing in court yesterday. He was a good person that had a career ahead of him that was planning on going higher, climbing higher, flying higher, and he was viciously gunned down in the streets of Brooklyn. This has to end. We have to come together as people of the city with our elected leaders and say something has to be done. The streets are gone mad. Fayaz was a police officer for five years stationed in Borough Park. He leaves behind a wife and two small boys on Long Island. Those who are on the job with him want people to remember his kindness and dedication. He loved his job, um, but he was also a fun person. He was very shy at time. He was um, very humbled. It's sad what happened. We're, gonna, we're all going to miss him. His legacy will always be alive in our hearts. Coney Island Avenue here behind me has already been shut down for several blocks ahead of the services which get underway today at 10 o'clock this morning and should be concluded by about 3 o'clock. We will hear from both the mayor and police commissioner speak at his funeral.